Hey everybody, my name is Bricky, and we are continuing the usual when it comes to videos with no Bricky in the corner. And I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna discuss the fact that there's like, oh, I'm not in the top corner anymore because at this, at this point, it's just like, if I'm up there, sometimes I am, sometimes I'm not, it really doesn't matter. But today we're playing a little bit of The Pig, which is something I haven't played a whole lot of, but I was kind of in the horror movie trend ever since watching the new Halloween movie. And so I was going through all the different characters and you know, I mean, I don't really want to play the Nightmare, that's for certain, and I really don't like the Cannibal. Myers is a lot of fun, but he, I don't know. Well, I don't have great perks on Myers, or at least I wish I had better perks and stuff. But the pig, I was kind of considering jumping a little bit on there. Um, and I thought it would be pretty cool to play a little bit of her and, and see some cool stuff you can do. When I said the pig right there, my voice didn't crack, but something definitely happened to it, and it sounded really funny. It kind of reminds me of one time when you know you try to do fake voice cracks, and you're just kind of like, oh yeah, I'm playing a little bit of the pig. <clears throat> that hurt a little bit. Anyway. Uh, so the pig build we got running right now is barbecue and chili, hex ruin, make your choice, and save the best for last. She does not have any of the cool things for this event that I want to pop, but I could pop it possibly a little bit later. And I'm, so I'm just using a spot owl wreath. But I'm also using combat straps and the videotape. Now, these are things that you generally use in a way to help deal with loops and survivors. You can pop down pretty quickly, and you can make that loop pretty... You can mess a loop up pretty well with this. Now, I normally like running things that give you that one extra mask and, I don't know, creative gears and things like that, but that's not necessarily what I was looking to do and uh, or looking to kind of make. I wanted to do more of an attack-based pig, and so that's what I'm going to be doing. And once I find a game, I will cut and we shall go. So, yeah. All right. So let's get this show on the road. They didn't pop anything special. I think it was just some more of the hook offerings and stuff like that. But, or the blight offerings, what they're called. But, yeah, I'm kind of curious to what map we're going to get. The game map would obviously really be really good. But the man with this specific add-on helps her with loops a lot. As it makes her dash not completely useless, and especially since people don't run sprint burst as much, it definitely helps. So, I'm going to see how this game turns out. If I get something like the Swamp, I'm probably going to have a pretty bad time. The Swamp kind of works two ways for the pig. On one hand, it's obviously it's the Swamp, so it's terrible for all killers. But it's actually not terrible sometimes because it forces the survivors to run a lot farther in order to get to jigsaw boxes to take their stuff off. So we'll have to see how it turns out because it could be pretty good. It could be kind of mediocre, but I don't know. We'll have to see. And I'm hoping that we won't have too hard of a time. The Mainly for the pig, the best way to play her well is to get some good hits on in the early game. And then once that happens, things can be a little bit uh, a little bit more on up your alley. Because you need to be able to hit them early and then down them early. And if you do those things early, then you have the traps on. Things can uh, start making your, like, work your way. Uh, but if you have a hard time and people start really taking gens before you can do anything, you might have a really rough time with her. I don't know. We'll have to see how it turns out. There's a lot of fun that can be had with this character. Once I uh, once I load, I'm, I will see how it turns out. Uh, th that's also something I was considering. So I was I was going through YouTube. And I was specifically looking up tags. So obviously, you know, I wanted to find the tags that associate themselves with Dead by Daylight and what tags uh, people search the most. And most of the time, it's Dead by Daylight, new killer, Dead by Daylight trailer, Dead by Daylight, etc. But one of them was DBD rank one. And I did not realize that that was such a common choice of tag to see rank one gameplay, I guess. I, I don't really know. But because of that, I was kind of considering an idea for a video. Torment Creek. Uh, not the best, but it's not bad. I can make it work. Um, I was considering making almost like a video of a uh, of like a sort of kind of guide with killers, even though I've already done that. More like a, I think I almost specifically used the exact words how to get to rank one, you know, how to get to rank one with each killers, each killer, and for, uh, wow, really, that actually stopped me? Wow. Um, and, you know, I don't know, it'd be kind of interesting for, like, a very, and unlike the case file, where the case file is really in-depth, 
I was thinking more along the lines of something a little bit simpler. You know, something more, uh, more just, hey, you know, here's a five minute video. This is a really good way to get to rank one with Freddy. And then just kind of leave it at that. Nothing too crazy, nothing too insane, you know? Like a, a pretty simple video that might be nice. And, you know, obviously I'm always looking for ways to grow the channel. And if this is one of those, per uh, one of those ways, then who knows? It could actually work out. Alright, she doesn't have dead hard. Good to know. Helmet on! I'm glad that I got her first because I was going to have an annoyance if I had to deal with a, uh... If I had to deal with my obsession later and lose all my Save the Best for Last stacks. But, I don't know. I might consider doing something of that nature. It would be enjoyable. And I know people, people want to see, you know, guides a lot of the times. And it's a lot of fun a lot of times. And who knows? Maybe you get something good. Oh, wow. She actually just kept on rolling. I didn't think she would get she'd do that. Wait, am I not far enough away for the... Uh, oh, there we go. I, I remember they said they changed up Make Your Choice. There it is. That's all I was looking for. And now, life is gonna get real good for your boy. Hey. You're gonna hate me for this. Sorry. Nice. Helmet! But, I mean, Case File, uh, my old Case File series, obviously it, it was ended, but the Case File series was a lot of, a lot of effort. There was a lot that was put into it. There was, I, I, I had people make thumbnails for me, I had people edit the videos, but it might be just kind of nice with a very simple, how to get to rank one with Freddy, and I just have, it's just gameplay with Freddy, and I just tell you over like a five minute video, something, something simple, you know, nothing too insane. I think it might actually be, uh, it might actually be something kind of useful, I don't know. Huh. Well, this made my life a lot easier. Oh, they already got the helmet off. That's unfortunate. Alright, well, let's see what we can do here. I'll take you down, and then I'm gonna go over here. Because I think it would be more behoove of me to try to take out this little, uh, Pained friend we got right in it, right here before I do anything else. And I gotta stop hitting that damn obsession. But I guess I'm gonna have to hit her again. Where did she go? Oh well. It's better to probably put her on a hook than do anything else right now. Up you go, girl. Yeah. Might be kind of fun. Might be kind of fun. I don't know. Everyone likes guides. Even if it's not even really a guide, it's just like a little bit of a helping hand. A little bit of a- everyone likes a little bit of a helping hand. Alright. There you are. Bounce landing? Oh no. Maybe they just jumped off for some reason. Okay, I should be easily able to get this one. Yeah, I knew you were gonna do that. I read you like a book! Okay, well, the traps seem to be slightly glitched, as they're invisible for a short period of time after I- before I want to put them on or whatever. But, ah oh well. Alright, up we go. That Megan over there, I'm going to assume, is the make your choice person. So I'm gonna... Well. Never mind. Everything that I needed to say was... <laughs> you know how they say a picture is worth a thousand words? Well, that, ac that action right there was worth the whole thing as well. Everything made sense. Ah, Deliverance! How interesting! I did not expect a Deliverance proc from her. Interesting timing, though. It might have been a little sooner than she should have gone with. Mainly I say that because I think she's going to end up having a real problem as she is running all the way over here. What For what reason, though? Oh, she didn't even run that far. There she is. Why, though? You made, you made a really... You really went far, right? And you can't heal yourself, either. You know, if the healing changes weren't already giving you a hard enough time, that you made it so that, uh... That this as well. Ah. Huh. Oh! <laughs> 
Oh, man. People these days. Oh, man. Oh, well. Hey, I'm not gonna cry any tears. This is any and everything that I wanted to happen. Uh... Do I want to take her down? I kinda do, but I also... I also don't want to lose my, uh, my save the best for last. I'm probably going to try to take her down anyway. Wait, really? Did I actually lose her? There she is. Damn. Well, I'm going to lose it anyway. But honestly, if I can trade my save the best for last stacks with a kill i would absolutely do that so wow i mean i th i think that was death hook for that person who you no it wasn't death hook for that person who used deliverance they 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 used deliverance so they would have been on second hook but they would have been on second hook with a um they would have been on second hook with a combination of not only second hook but they also would have had the difficult problem of still having the trap on their head so I can, I get why they were salty and they didn't want to keep playing, but come on, dude. Why you got to be that way? Why you got to be that way? Oh, I forgot to mention. I, I should say this because I kind of forgot. Um, this is not rank one. This is like rank nine. Um, but granted, it's a little bit weird right now because of the rank reset. So the rank reset, so I haven't fully made my way back to rank one. Normally I do that when I do a stream or something. Uh, you know, I just play a lot and then make my way back up. But uh, it is the rank reset, so even the rank 1 survivors and the not rank 1 survivors kind of all jumbled together right now. Wait. Did they actually run back? Was I just not looking? Am I just blind? I think I'm just blind. I could always appreciate a, a nice little charged attack just for some extra points. There we go. Well... Look at that four man. Not a single generator done. There's a possibility that they were actually just getting those little blight things instead of gens, which is fair. Like this one. But, uh, that was certainly a game with the pig. I might have still been able to get a four man five gens if that Feng Min didn't disconnect, but she did. And, oh well, I got a little bit of extra. I got a little bit extra. It's always funny when people DC like that. I don't know. It just gets me. It makes it, it gives me the good giggles. And I wasn't even camp in this game either. I absolutely camp in this game whenever the time is necessary, which unfortunately for overly altruistic teams is more often than I would like. But I didn't even have to today. I was just rolling around, taking people down. Did they have like a really good item they wanted to preserve or something? No, they didn't even have a good build. They had deliverance, but. I mean, alert is kind of cool for now, but I think iron will. I mean, it's not a bad build actually, but oh well, no items or offerings or anything. Ah oh, well, maybe they just didn't want to die. Who knows? I'm not one who can understand people. Well, anyway, with that, I'm gonna go to my spirit and throw some more stuff into her so I can get some more perks. Come on, good perks. I will accept Monitor and Abuse 3. What's more, what I more so like about Monitor and Abuse 3 is that now I don't have to worry about it anymore. And that's more important to me than actually just getting Monitor and Abuse. It's just like kind of having it removed. For the blood web, that is. Well, solid games. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. I appreciate it. And I'll see you later. And if, of course, like before, if you're at TwitchCon, come say hi. If you're not, well, next year. All right, bye-bye.